Hey guys, this is Trini Roots and it is Thanksgiving morning. I just wanted to share with you guys something that I made today. I made a sweet potato pie. I'm going to bring it for you. I actually made three sweet potato pies, but... Mmm, smell of vision <laughs> I kind of snagged it right there and this is actually kind of like a little product review but not for hair stuff I got this pie crust shield from amazon.com it's a silicone pie crust and for those of you who actually make pies you know how difficult it can be to get the filling for the pie baked and not burn the crust at the same time and so, I was thinking, well, surely there's something better to use than foil. A lot of times I'll just, you know, cover the pie crust loosely with foil to keep it from browning while the pie was allowed to, to bake. But I decided to go online and look for pie crust shields. And I saw a lot of metal ones, a lot of silicone ones. And, you know, there really is a wide selection out there for, for pie crust shields. But this adjustable... It's adjustable. This adjustable silicone pie crust shield has really been great for me this morning. Um, you can use it for anywhere from an eight inch pie to a 10 inch pie. And it has these little notches along the side of it so that you can put this portion, this part into it. So you would use a, the furthest notch for the largest pies and as the pies get smaller you move it in move it in move it in and use the notches further in and I mean my pie crust actually it came out perfectly I'm gonna bring it for you again on the on the actual shield it says you can't you can't read it but it says tan don't burn it's written on the shield tan don't burn and that's exactly what happened I mean the pie crust came out it has a beautiful color it's not burned it's not too light either so this is my sweet potato pie for those of you pie makers out there you should definitely try this thing out it is a godsend Anyway, and I guess some of you guys are probably wondering what I did to my hair. I actually pin curled my hair um, a couple of days ago. I washed my hair and actually twisted the front row loosely. So it's not quite a full retwist, but I just did the front row. And I, um, I sprayed my hair with water. And I used a little bit of the, um, the, the spritz, the Talia Wajid. Uh, protective mist and I just went ahead I pulled my hair into loose loose twists and wrapped it around my finger and then I pinned it in place so I pulled it into loose twists wrapped it around my finger put my finger like this and kind of wrapped it around removed my finger and then pinned it in place I'm um, maybe I'll come up and do a um, I'll do a tutorial for that style but it kind of gives you the look of a uh, bantu knot out but the curls are actually looser so I hope you guys are having happy holidays hope you're, you're enjoying the time spent with friends and family hope you're enjoying some good food and let me do a turnaround for you No, nothing special. Anyway, happy holidays. See you guys later. Bye.